Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Tuesday. We're coming at you with 2019 Panini Spectral Football 4-Box. Pick your team number 19. The second half of the case we popped open, break 20 actually filled up first. So the second break of the case is going to be, actually be 19. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into it, for picking their team straight up in break 19 on the 17th of September. Evan, Last Bot Mojo Dolphins. Remember, if you have at least two teams, you'll be eligible for that $50 of break credit. We'll do the randomizer for that at the very end. All right. Good luck, boys and girls. Well, how are uh, how is everyone feeling about their football teams following week two? What's what's the overreactions, the knee jerk reactions after week two? I guess my Raiders are not going sixteen and zero this year after falling to the Chiefs on Sunday. Big losses for Pittsburgh and New Orleans. Both of them losing their starting quarterbacks. Big Ben out for the year. Dust off your Mason Rudolph autographs. Drew Brees lost for six to eight weeks. Maybe a Teddy Bridgewater revival is in order. We'll see. We'll use this blank card right here to slow play the hits. Good luck, everybody. There's Pat Tillman. Nice, Pat Tillman. 32 out of 99. Chris with the Cardinals. We got Justice Hill. Monumental relic for the Purple Birds. Travis Melberg. Ravens looking good. Ravens going into Kansas City. So that's going to be a big test for them to see if they are for real or not. There is Pillars of the Game, Terry Bradshaw, Michael Gallucci with the Steelers. All right, folks, let's ask, I'll ask you this. Uh, let's see if I could try to word this right. The loss of the quarterback, Pittsburgh, New Orleans. Who does it hurt the most, losing their starting quarterback? Does losing Ben, Big Ben, hurt worse for the uh, uh, Steelers? I almost said Pirates. Steelers? Or does losing Drew Brees, who's more important to that team? And I guess that also includes, like, what about the replacement? Who's a better replacement? If that makes sense. Now, Dave's saying losing Brees hurts the Saints more than the Steelers losing Big Ben. AJ says Steelers. This redemption says... Radiant Rookie, Patch Signatures, Neon Blue, card 16. And that's going to go to T O Tony. Tony Pollard for the Dallas Cowboys. That's going to be for Aaron Salinas with the boys. Ooh. See, AJ thinks Saints still make the playoffs and we'll have Breeze back in time for the playoffs. Yeah, could this be a blessing in disguise for Drew Brees, who is getting older, gets to take six to eight weeks off, comes back with a fresh arm? There's Easton Stick, neon green die cut to 30. I don't know, maybe maybe losing Big Ben is like a good is like a blessing in disguise. They can kind of start their the Steelers can sort of start their youth movement. 22 out of 30. Jason Allen says, hurts Pittsburgh more. Saints still have a decent team. There's Marshawn Lynch, 12 out of 35. Neon green. Still Raiders edition there. That'll be for David Duffy with my Raiders. Twenty-five out of ninety-nine building blocks. Damian Harris, nice triple relic for the Pat Riots. Mike Luongo with that. 
Thatcher, what's going on? Welcome. And there's Cleland Farrell, 48 out of 50 for my Raiders. Neon Green, Raiders rebuilding. David Duffy with the silver and black. Questions about Jameis Wynn? Who is he? Is he week one, Jameis? Or is he week two, Jameis? $7.99. That's for the Buccaneers. That is for uh, Michael Gallucci. We got Max Impact, Joe Theismann. Redskins Relic for Evan. Neon Pink. 13 out of 15 on that one. We got High Voltage, Devontae Adams, Relic. Sixty one out of ninety-nine. Brian Langley with the Packers, and we've got Darius Slayton. Jersey and autograph for the Giants. New York football Giants, Jameson Long. Daniel uh, Daniel Jones It's going to be making the start this week, folks. Future future Hall of Famer Eli Manning benched. Future Hall of Famer, right? Two Super Bowls. Ray Lewis to 60. What time is it game time going to Travis Melberg and the Purple Birds? We got Masked Marvels, J.J. Watt, Neon Green. I'm rooting for Daniel Jones. That's hashtag good for the hobby, folks. Especially if he does well. 12 out of 30. Texans, Michael Gallucci. We got Building Blocks, Nick Bosa, Triple Relic for the Niners. That's going to be for Eric J, Eric Jock, with that. Niners looking good so far, 62 out of 99. And we've got Noah Fant, two-color patch and autograph. Neon Pink, brutal loss for the Broncos. Kind of a wild one at the end there. That goes to Travis Melberg, a little oppo Joe Mojo as a Raiders guy. 8 out of 25. And next box. What other players, ladies and gentlemen, from either the 2018 class or this current 2019 class, hashtag good for the, who's hashtag good for the hobby this week? Were there some good rookie standout performances? Or maybe some second year player standout performances? I'm trying to think. Man, Meikle Hardman Jr. on the Chiefs. I was I was watching my Raiders game. He had like a 73-yard touchdown taken back because of a silly Chiefs penalty. Man, if Hardman, yeah, AJ's agreeing with that. If Hardman had that, think about the numbers that he would have. Woo! That would be hashtag good for the hobby. Without Tyreek Hill, Hardman could really could really emerge. Who else? Who else is hashtag good for the hobby? There's Drew Locke, 86 out of 99 for the Broncos, Travis. Who's been hashtag good for the hobby? Especially players in the last couple, drafted in the last couple years. Last year's class and this year's class. No Fant, rising rookie, dual relic for Bronco. Another one for Travis Melberg. 13 out of 75. We got Thurman Thomas, pillars of the game relic for the Bills. David Duffy to 199. 
right? Hawkinson week one. What did ha what did TJ Hawkinson do this week? Just one, just three targets, one, one reception for seven yards. But, yeah, TJ Hawkins definitely had a great first week. I want to see him. Yeah, I want, I want to see him keep going week three. <coughs> DK Metcalf, right, Thatcher? That's hashtag good for the hobby. Marquise Brown is hashtag good for the hobby. He's been playing well. Three color patch and neon pink autograph and making some big plays, Travis Melberg. The combination of, of production and highlight plays will definitely be hashtag good for the hobby. That's what that's all we want. 18 out of 25. And Lamar Jackson too, last year. Rookie. A lot of hashtag good for the hobby. All right, die cut. Quinn and Williams. Jets. 45 out of 50. Poor Jets quarterbacks. Although Sam Darnold is not, I guess, contagious anymore with mono, so he's, I think he's back at practice. But he just can't get hit. I'm sure everyone has learned by now. This die cut goes to Michael. Um, and I'm no doctor, but this, I'm just repeating what I see on TV, right? Uh, your spleen gets enlarged with that infection, so so like health wise, you could be like, I'm fine, guys, you know, and it's frustrating, but like your spleen can enlarge. So if you get a hit in the spleen area, I think it's that side. If you get a hit in the spleen, that could that then that could be really scary, and then lead to a much worse injury. Josh Allen, it's been looking good. Bills are two and zero, folks. It's hashtag good for the hobby. There you go. That's a good one, Dave. Terry, Terry McLaurin for the Redskins. It's going to be a should be a bright spot for that Redskins team. We got building blocks. Tony Pollard, who I had drafted as a Ezekiel Elliott backup, but looks like looks like it's not yet Tony Pollard's time to shine. That will be for the boys, Aaron Salinas, but still possibly part of the future. Of course, Josh Jacobs. Right? How could I forget about? Raiders running back Josh Jacobs, who in a losing effort still had, was a yard short of 100 yards rushing. 12 carries, 99 yards. No touchdowns, but Josh Jacobs hashtag good for the hobby. There's Andy Dalton, 26 out of 35. Autograph. I thought there was an Andy Dalton revival in week one when he almost came back and beat the Seahawks, but then Bengals kind of came down to earth in week two. Brian Watford, though, See how see how his season ends up. You never know. You don't see his auto too often anymore either. Nice Andy Dalton. There's Jamal Adams. Out of 99, some issues there. With the Jets. Steel curtain with that one. There's Max Impact, Josh Allen. Allen. I love uh, I love the Josh Allen story, David Duffy with the Bills. I think there was a, like some some pre draft hype, and then some like post draft. Oh, he's not as good. You know, early in the season he didn't look very good last year, but then end of the season, second half of the season, pretty strong. Looks like he's still continuing to improve. Hashtag good for the hobby. Pillars of the game, Warren Moon, Oilers stuff, of course, goes to the Titans. Robert Roar with the Tennessee Titans. Brian Mathers saying John Ross finally starting to break out, though. True. That is good. I finally healthy, right, for the most part? At a 199. And we got Gary Jennings Jr. Nice patch, nice autograph. And that will be for the Seahawks. Harrison Lewis with the Hawks. Three out of 99. There's Calvin Johnson, neon blue. 
12 out of 60. Yeah, Josh Allen is built like Big Ben. That's for sure. It's going to be good for a long time. I hope so. That'd be cool. That would be hashtag good for the hobby. Mass Marvel's Todd Gurley. Bills have a pretty interesting team, don't they? Like, I feel like on paper, or I mean, they're certainly underrated. They just don't have a lot of, like... They don't have a lot of sexy names on the team. I mean, Frank Gore's old. Singletary, I guess, is there. But, I mean, does, does John Brown and Cole Beasley... Receive? Do they strike fear into your heart? Zay Jones? No, but but you put everything together and all of a sudden they're like, oh, we're 2-0. Oh. <laughs> Out of 99 on that one. That will be for uh, Evan and the Rams. Back here, we're just talking about you. Josh Jacobs, building blocks. Edward saying, not Joe, not going to be fun dealing with Mahomes for the next 10 years. We just have to wait for that one off here <laughs> from Patrick Mahomes. 45 out of 99, building blocks, Raiders. David, Dull. all we need to do, Edward, for the next 10 years, Raiders just need to get a wild card spot. Maybe the, maybe the Chiefs blow it in, in the first week of the playoffs, and then the Raiders just kind of work on, work on through. Uh, we got Easton Stick, 54 out of 99. Nice nice colors there and autograph. Uh, James, XR Football is a new release. That drops tomorrow. New releases are Wednesdays and Wednesdays and Fridays. So that's for the Bolts. That's going to be for Sean. I know, yeah. The, the, that, that, that one quarter of Raiders giving up all those points in one quarter. If you told me, Edward, that the Raiders kept the Chiefs scoreless for three quarters, I would have been like, yeah, that's a Raiders win. Raiders somehow pulled off a win, is what I would say. But it would be a trick question, because you would tell me then that the Raiders... <laughs> then, then the, it's a trick question because the Chiefs scored 28 points in the second quarter. That's the problem. Well, listen, the Raiders, you know, the Raiders know what they need to do, Edward, for the next 10 years, right? You just keep drafting defense, keep drafting pass rushers. You know, you got to. They've got to improve that secondary. Keep improving all facets of that part of the game. Listen, most teams are probably not going to be able to keep up offensively with the Chiefs. But what you can attempt to do is to maybe slow them down a little bit with some good defense. Josh Oliver, 68 out of 99. Yeah, what's with the, uh, what's with the Chargers and kicking? Brutal. Josh Oliver for the Jags, 99. Remember that one Korean-American kid they had? <laughs> or no, maybe, I think he was born in Korea, but he went to, like, he went to elementary and high school in the United States. Um, but, like, he was brutal. You know, the... There's Max, speaking of the Chargers, Max Impact, Joey Bosa, Chargers, Sean with that one. Right, Young Ho. Brutal. Do you give up a first rounder for Jalen? Well, everyone answer that question. Do you, does your team give up a first round draft pick for Jalen Ramsey? Do you do it? Pillars of the game, Mike Singletary. I mean, Raiders are probably going to draft a safety anyway, or a, a, a defensive back anyway in the first round, right? I'm only, as for the Raiders, speaking just for the Raiders, Mike Singletary, 
goes to the Bears. Boombox with the Bears. Boombox, remember what Mike Singletary said? I'd rather play with 10 people and just get penalized all the way until we have to do something else rather than play with 11 when I know that right now that person is not sold out to be part of this team. It's more about them than it's about the team. Cannot play with them, Boombox. Cannot win with them. Cannot coach with them. Can't do it. I want winners. I want players that want to win. Me too, Mike. Me too, Mike Singletary. All right, and we've got Corey Davis, Titans. Yeah, A.J. Brown, decent start to his career too. And the Titans. Brian Matthews says, no, Ramsey's a cancer. I don't know, he, he seemed convincing to me. When he was like, hey, I, I didn't want those, tr you know, I want to be traded stuff to get out in the public. Robert Rohr with the Titans. But they want two first rounders now? That that Then I would say no. There's Drew Brees. And you got to pay him too? 28 out of 50 Drew Brees die cut. Get well soon. Evan with the Saints. Well, just I don't know. I mean, I feel like the, I feel like the, if the Raiders were, yeah, it's not like Jalen Ramsey's Khalil Mack. Jason Jaspi is saying. There's Drew Brees. Evan with the Saints. There's Marquise Brown. Four out of four for Hollywood Brown. Nice. Travis Melberg with the Purple Birds. There you go. Travis, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Max Impact, Steven Jackson. Yeah, St. Pax 12 with a good joke. The Pats will take him. They need help on D. <laughs> yeah, I don't think they need any more help. 11 out of 15, Steven Jackson, Conrad with the Falcons. I mean, the, if the Raiders were one corner away from, like, playoffs and a deep run, I'd be like, yeah, sure, you go for it. But Raiders have a lot of work to do, so I don't think you do that at that point. And there's Andre Risen. Bad Moon Risen, illustrious legends. That'll be for the Falcons. That's going to be for Conrad. Nice one, Conrad. Steven Jackson and Andre Rise, a couple old school Falcons. 49 out of 99. Saquon Barkley, neon pink, 15 out of 20. Fifteen out of twenty. Josh York saying Saints could use him. Yeah. I'm back, Kyle Kramer. Hunter Renfro. David Duffy with Renfro. Well, I like the Renfro. Uh, Jimmy, yeah, regarding Kaepernick, I mean, it's just, yeah, he, there's just too much of a media circus that surrounds him. For a backup quarterback. He's just been out of the game too long. Got to learn playbooks. Got to learn all sorts of things. Get back, get back up to the speed of the game. There's Dan Fouts for the Chargers. Yeah, there's a lot of factors in the way. Oh! Daniel Jones. Jersey and autograph for the New York football Giants. Jameson Long. He's getting his first start this week, ladies and gentlemen. I'm rooting for him. I want him to do well. And that's 10 out of 15. Nice. Yeah, it's going to be a rough start for him. 
Uh, what does he have? Saquon Barkley, Evan Ingram. That's about it. But there you go, Jameson. That's the future right there. Looks like we got Juju Smith-Schuster. Three out of 15. I like that pattern that they have there, Spectra. That's nice. Steelers. Michael Gallucci with the Steelers, of course. I agree, Gil. That'd be hashtag good for the hobby. That's what I'm all about. Hashtag good for the hobby. We got Rookie Aura, Marquise Brown. I love these Rookie Aura designs. It's sort of like a sort of like a Celtic pattern in the background, right? One out of 50. Ravens, Travis Melbourne. I guess they do get, what, the Golden Tate's going to be back in a couple weeks? That'll help. That should help. What up, Alfred? When's Bowman Chrome breaks two and three going to run? Tomorrow. Drops tomorrow, Alfred. All new releases are Wednesdays and Fridays. Daniel Jones, Monumental Relic, New York Football Giants. Another one for Jameson. Twelve out of fifteen. Good luck, Daniel Jones. And we've got Dexter Lawrence, another New York football giant. It's another one for James Long. There you go. Last box coming up. Then we got a quick one box random pack break of contenders draft picks basketball happening. And then I'm not sure what we're gonna do after that. I do see a handful of orders coming in, but I don't know where that money is going. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Maybe pre-orders. There is a pre-order promo going on tonight, folks, so take a look at jazbeescasebreaks.com. Josh York apologizing for your boy Pete Alonzo destroying Bellinger's home run NL rookie record. You don't have to apologize. We're about, we're about trying to win titles, not about individual awards, Josh. I don't even think about that. Beat all those records. I don't care. This is the just so long as the Dodgers can make it and then win a World Series. That's all I care about. I will give up every single individual award. I would give back every Clayton Kershaw Cy Young. I would give up every record that the Dodgers hold. Oral Hershiser scoreless inning record, all of that. For World Series rings. I mean, I don't get a ring, but you know what I mean. When you're a Mets fan, you can't be a bad title. Josh York is saying you have to focus on the individual records. Well, I'll give you that then. Congrats to Pete Alonso. Pete Alonso, baseball-wise, hashtag good for the hobby. All right, there's Daniel Jones. Die cut, 21 out of 50. Quarterback for a big market team. If this guy can, can do well, ooh. all of a sudden this could be, this could, Daniel Jones could have a strong value in the secondary market. There's Adam Thielen, neon green, out of 35. That is for the Vikings, Damian with the Vikes. Twenty one out of thirty five. And a one of one Barry Sanders. Wow. Milestone moments. NFL Players Association tag in there. Two thousand yards in nineteen ninety seven. Gotta be over to the yeah. That is awesome. Who's got the Lions in this one? Travis Melberg. There he is. He's in the chat. Joe, that's awesome, he says. It is awesome. And for his Lions PC. There you go, man. Barry wore that. 
Travis all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Oh, he just turned on the stream, too. Perfect timing, man. Then we got Terry McLaurin. Nice patch, nice autograph. He could be hashtag good for the hobby as the season goes on. His week one was really good. Patrick Goodwin saying Braves versus Dodgers in the World Series. Well, that doesn't, doesn't work like that, Patrick. Patrick, baseball, not his strong suit. 82 out of 199. Evan with the Redskins. <laughs> Travis Melberg is shaking. He's at work. Leave work. Go home. Say, I just got a one-on-one -on -one Barry Sanders relic out of Spectra Football. I can leave work. There's Peyton Manning. Anyone watch Peyton's Places? Is that good? It looks funny. Is Peyton Places good? It's funny? It looks like it's gonna be, it would be funny. I gotta start watching that. That goes to Evan and the Colts. There's Jalen Hurd, Rookie Aura. One out of 30. All right, Rex, that makes more sense. Dodgers, Yankees. That's an AL team and an NL team. Not NL and NL. That doesn't work. And Major League Baseball would love to see a Yankees, Dodgers, Yankees World Series. And the TV networks. Nice Jalen Hurd for the Niners. Eric Jock with that. Drew Locke, monumental relic for the Broncos. That's going to be Travis Melberg. Yeah, well, that's what I, I saw the uh, the commercial with him with Peyton Manning and Fred Belitnikov, Jason Jaspi. So that kind of was like, I was like, huh, let's check that out. That looks fun. All right, David Montgomery, three-color patch, neon green ink autograph going to Mark and the Bears. We're doing uh, break 19 right now, Josh York, if you look in the chat. Spectra 19 doing now, 20 filled first, and we already uploaded that one. We kind of went second half first, or break 20 first, now we're doing 19. So since it's sold out, I think we took it off the site. David Montgomery, neon green autograph for the Bears. Boombox once again. Gil saying he's at work. He's shaking about this Barry Sanders. Pretty cool, right? There's Derek Carr. It's gonna be a rough next few weeks for the Raiders. They got a pretty tough schedule. Uh, no, we don't, Josh. If we did, it'd be on the site. Uh, no, what I'm dropping in the chat Josh is the uh, is the schedule. That's what I'm dropping in the chat. Now Spectra 19, 20 already filled and loaded, and then after this will be the one box random pack break, and then after that will be I don't know what's after that. There's Derek Carr. There's Marcus Mariota to 199 after Burner's rally. He's a bit of his legs last week. Looks pretty good. Robert Rohr with the Titans. Gronk, 90 out of 99. When's he going to rejoin the Patriots? Josh Gordon, Antonio Brown, Gronkowski, Edelman, Tom Brady, their, their amazing defense. <laughs> Sony Michelle, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And then they'll just add Gronk in week 10, 10 or 12 or something like that. Another Super Bowl for the Pats. 
Back here is Neon Dion Sanders, 48 out of 50. On card Hall of Fame autograph. It's pretty nice. Conrad with the Dirty Birds. This is Falcons edition. Wow. That's pretty cool. A Barry Sanders one of one and a Dion Sanders Hall of Fame autograph. All right, last pack, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. This was a really nice case. Seven out of ten, David Montgomery. Die cut for the Bears. And football fans, we got uh, you can pre-order tonight collegiate, flawless collegiate football and XR football tonight. And those two football breaks are, are the only two breaks that are part of tonight's pre-order promo. Check out the details on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Boombox with the Bears. Next up is Alexander Madison, monumental relic for Damian Stock and the Vikings. One ninety-eight out of one ninety-nine. Then we've got Alvin Kamara, lights Kamara action. Next era relic for the Saints. Evan with the Saints, without the services of Drew Brees for a little bit. But hey, maybe that means more carries for Alvin Kamara. Thirty-six out of ninety-nine. And the last one here is Drew Locke. Three color patch and autograph. Neon green ink autograph for Travis Melberg and the Broncos. He's had a nice break too. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for getting into that Spectra. That was a good way to start our Tuesday. And let's give away some money. Would love to get that flawless collegiate going, Josh Short, but that drops tomorrow. New releases are Wednesdays and Fridays. All right, so let's go back to the list right here. Let's sort by your first names. Spectra 19. And let's see who's going to get $50 break credit. You have to buy at least two. So Brian bought at least two. That gets him one entry. Conrad bought at least two. That gets one entry. David Duffy bought at least two. That's one entry. Eric bought at least two, that's one entry. Now, Evan got five. So four of those teams are eligible. Four gets you two entries, Evan. Boombox with one. Gallucci, Mike. Steel Curtain gets four. He gets two entries. And Travis has bought four teams, so he gets two entries as well. All right, so that is... 11 names total, one of those 11 spots are going to get $50 break credit from jazbeescasebreaks.com after eight times, two and a six. Name on top gets it, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Good luck, name on top. <laughs> what a break for Travis Melberg. It was inevitable, right? A monster break for him, and he gets the $50 of break credit. So, Travis, keep your eye on your email box. Your break credit will be there. Thanks and congrats to Travis. Thank you very much, everybody, for getting in. We'll see you next time. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.